chairs. Today I'll be modernizing these older style green rocking chairs that I found on Facebook Marketplace for free. I start by flipping the chair over so I can take off the old metal rocker. I grab my drill and set it in reverse to get the screws out. A little trick to getting them out easier is to push down on your drill really hard. This pressure makes it easier to get the screws out. Wow, is that metal base ever heavy? Here I've cut two pieces of wood to match the existing wood on the bottom of the chair. I'm then placing the wood on each of the ends and screwing it in. Folding over the skirt of the chair and stapling it to the wood. As I'm pulling the fabric under, I'm making sure to pull really tight before I staple. Don't be afraid to put lots of staples in. This is going to be underneath of the chair, so once it's flipped over, you won't see any of these. Now just repeat this process for each of the four sides. What it should look like once you've stapled it all down. I got these plates at my local hardware store. I fit them as close as I can to the edge of the chair without them being seen. I did grab longer screws than what came with it as these ones seem to be a bit too short. And then just repeat the process on each of the four sides. I got a bit so that I could screw holes into where we're going to put the legs. Make sure that the bit you grab is the same size or smaller. Now just grab your legs and screw them in. Now flip your chair over to make sure that it's level. If it's not, you're going to have to play around with the legs a little bit. To finish this piece up before you sell it, you want to grab your carpet cleaner and shampoo. I put my carpet shampoo into this old Windex bottle as the one on my machine is currently not working. I spray a generous amount onto my chair until it's wet to the touch. I'm using a Bissell handheld carpet cleaner. I then like to use the brush on it to scrub all over the piece. Then once this is done, I take the brush nice and slow and make sure to go from one end to the other. 
You do not want to rush this step. If you look closely, you can see just how dirty this piece really is. I then continue to clean the whole chair, making sure to get into all the little creases. to show you how I stage it and then take photos for Facebook Marketplace. So here I'm just placing a picture and some knickknacks and then I just take a few good pictures, make sure to edit them so that they look good and also make sure that you show any imperfections in your photos like I've done here with the arm. you just open up Facebook Marketplace, add it, click all the pictures that you want into your listing. And then you're going to put in a title. So here I've just titled it MCM Chairs. And then you want to put a price. I've done $200 because I'm hoping to sell each chair for $100. And then you just add your description. So here I've put green velvet chair. making sure to include that it's for both of the chairs and not just one. And then I also put will deliver. And here I'm just adding to see any photos for imperfections. Then you're gonna wanna add your tags. So I've done chair, MCM, Velvet, Let's recap. I got these chairs off of Facebook Marketplace for free. I put $100 into them and I've listed them for $200, giving me a $100 profit. Thanks for watching.